This is Chicago's very own WGN Morning News at 8. Time for Round Town. Hey, Anna. Hey, good morning, Rob and Larry. Mostly Robin. Do you remember those days with babies where you didn't know what to do with them on a cold winter yeah. day? And uh-huh. Well, these places were my lifesaver when Amelia was a little baby. Uh, this is Bubbles Academy, but it's moved on from being an open play place. Good morning, Natalie. Good morning. To a center of education for preschoolers. What's going on behind us? Exactly. Well, this is our Bubble Music Babies class. Um, some of our youngest friends are in for some singing, moving, baby sign, yoga, all sorts of stimulation with their favorite grown-ups. How old are these babies? These babies are between two and six months. And how long are the classes when they're this small? I don't remember. <laughs> um, 45 minutes, um, but we also have our facility open, so um, parents are welcome to stay and play as long as they like throughout the day. That's what's cool about these places like Bubbles Academy, that you take a class here, and then when they have open play, you can come and hang out with the kids. Of course, I did this with the first one. Ask me how many classes I've taken Alex to, Robin. <laughs> exactly. It just means you don't love him as much. That's, That's right, all. and he doesn't mind. <laughs> Thank you, Larry. What uh -huh. time was that so I can show him later? <laughs> <laughs> we'll have more from Bubbles. Back to you. Anna's at the Bubbles Academy in Lincoln Park. Hey, Anna. Good morning. We're elevating Tommy time. This I never did. This I did for fun. I mean, I did have Tommy time for the kids, but it was on the carpet. What are you trying to teach him here? Well, some of our babies get uncomfortable doing traditional tummy time, but it's still important for them to work on those um, head, neck, and core muscles so they stay on track developmentally. So we're giving them some fun options to engage with their parent um, or grown up with mirrors. Uh, bonding with, with with mom there um, on your legs, balancing them. So if your little one has trouble doing tummy time, this is a great way to help them get that important skill in. I'm telling you, this is school for the first time parent too, because you are so lost when you have that first baby that these places kind of tell you, hey, if he hates tummy time, this is a good way to do it. We'll have more from Bobbles Academy coming up around town from Lincoln Park. Back to you. Anna's at Bubbles Academy in Lincoln Park. Hey, Anna. If you are having a baby, invest in Cheerios and Bubbles. Trust me. The kids love them. Uh, and I thought, Natalie, for the longest time that it was just because they love Bubbles. But you say there's a, an educational, a motor skill component. To explain it to me. Exactly. So our little babies right now, the Bubbles are providing visual stimulation for them. And they're also working on their eye tracking, an important skill right at this developmental stage, following the Bubbles with their eyes. Perfect. When we come back, more from Bubbles Academy and more cute babies. Time now for Round Town. Anna's in Lincoln Park at Bubbles Academy. Hey, Anna. I was telling you earlier when I had my first daughter, Bubbles Academy and these kinds of places that offer indoor activities for kids are your lifesavers, especially with that first kid in the winter. I'm here with Natalie from Bubbles. Good morning. Good morning. So explain what you do here for preschoolers. Oh, excellent. Well, this is our preschool preparation class. So we have um, a tiered preschool program. So this first class um, is a parent and child class okay. where they're doing a sample preschool day. Then they slowly work into independence where the the um, parent sits on the side of the room during the class, and then eventually a gentle separation, and then the last step is full-on preschool. In other words, so when your kid is three and you decide to drop him off at preschool, you don't have to run out bawling your eyes out while your kid screams, no! <laughs> this kind of eases them into the process. When was this discovered? When was this developed as a good idea for that transition? Well, actually, our founders, um, their, when their child um, turned two and a half, mm -hmm. he was having some issues issues with separation and a hard time um, having mom leave his side and so um, really she developed this program um, based on his needs and we found that if we pay attention to each individual child's separation needs then they have a much more successful transition to preschool. Perfect and we will give you more details about Bubbles because they give you like a free trial period at some point. They have free valet parking. We'll show you more from Bubbles Academy in Lincoln Park coming up around town. Time now for Round Town. Hey, Anna. Hey, good morning. We're at Bubbles Academy learning all about early childhood education, very early childhood education. These guys are between one and two years old, right? Exactly. These are our, our walkers in our creative movement class. So they are all over our giant meadow room. We give them lots of room for gross motor play. <laughs> and, right. and freeze. Exactly. I like these pointing at her. Your eyes. I see your eyes. <gasps> 
Jump. Now, now jump. God, they're cute. And so this is good because if you live in a small apartment like a lot of us do in the city, this gives them ample space to run and pretty much polish those walking skills. Exactly. We're big believers that at this age they're learning to move and moving to learn. So the more they move, um, the more they learn. It's adorable. So how does it work? Do they sign up for one class at a time? Do they have a membership? Well, we're very flexible, especially at this age. Mm -hmm. um, we like to offer a lot of options for families so they can sign up for one class at a time. Mm -hmm. Everyone's always welcome to come in for a free trial to try out a class or you can sign up for a full session um, if you know your schedule. All right, when we come back more from Bubbles Academy in Lincoln Park, back to you. Time now for Round Town. Hey, Anna. Good morning, I'm a Bubbles Academy. It all started way back when, and it was like an open playroom area, indoors for mommies who had babies that needed to get out of the cold and play inside. Now, it has a full-blown preschool. Good morning, Natalie. Good morning. So tell me a little bit about the preschool program. Is it full-time? How does it work? Yes, right now, this is our, our half-day arts integrated preschool. So um, you're seeing right now a three to four-year-old class, and they're here Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Friday morning. Um, however, next fall we'll be having a three-year-old program, a four-year-old program, and offering half and full day options. Is it drop-off or are the parents with them? Exactly. It is drop-off. However, we have a gentle separation philosophy. Mm -hmm. So if some of our kiddos need a little bit more time um, with their parent in the room, uh, we set up a transition process for um, each family. Gentle separation. I like that. Rather than drop them off and hear them scream <laughs> as you cry on the way out. And they, you have another great room in here. We have it empty because the kids are learning right now. Um, <laughs> you have this room here where they can have their Reese's and so on. Exactly. So all of our, our programs are art and movement based. So right. in addition to all sorts of basic skills, movement is a huge part um, of their development. And parents ask me, you know, how do I know when my child is ready to read? And I often tell them, well, are they skipping yet? Um, so you can really tell a lot from their motor development. That's really interesting because my son Alex has had issues with feeding, with chewing and so on. And what we did most of the time was have him play. The physical therapist had him just play around and now he's much better. Except now he's a picky eater. But whatever, I'm not going to bother you with my details. Tell me about the array of classes you have now at Bubbles. Because again, when I started here many years ago, when I came a couple of times, it was just playing and classes for babies. Great, yes. So we offer programs for um, newborns all the way up to age six. Mm -hmm. So, oh, and our choo choo preschool train is going to be coming on in. Mm -hmm. um, so we have um, classes for newborns and parents. Mm -hmm. Then we offer music classes mm -hmm. for our young babies. We have a pre crawlers class that focuses on um, motor development to help those crawlers. Mm -hmm. And then they go on to uh, <laughs> crawling, um, a reach, bubble reach, which is in between crawling and walking. Then we have a class just for walkers. And once they're confidently walking, we have creative movement. Goodness, you can raise my child here, Natalie. <laughs> exactly. That's I, what we say. We want to be your home. I have to say, these percent. places are awesome when you're a first-time mom and you're reading your books. I was telling Natalie. And the kid is not textbook friendly. Friendly. He's not doing everything the book told me he will be doing. And here, you have the advice of other people, and you can, you know, they'll help you through the process of first-time parenting, which is very difficult, and the kids have a lot of fun. You can try it out for free. Exactly. All of our classes, we offer free trials, whether it's ballet, art, mm -hmm. cooking, yoga. Um, we have any number of classes, and you're always welcome to give a trial to see um, if it's a good fit for your child. Then you can also sign up for a full session of classes mm -hmm. once you know what you want to take. How long is that? How many weeks? Um, that is seven weeks or you could buy a flexible class pass that is um, five classes, ten classes, okay. or fifteen and you can schedule around your little one's nap. The best you can do is look at their website. Thank you so much. Bubbles Academy in Lincoln Park. <laughs> Guys, that's around town for Wednesday. Back to you.